What's up guys? Welcome to the shop and welcome to my channel. My name is Austin and we're going to pull the diff on this 400 tonight. Reason being, um, last video right here, we diagnosed the knocking noise. We figured out it's coming from the rear. So let's get in and dive in and pull this diff and swim in some gear oil. Super grippy. Uh, they seem, seem to be wearing pretty good. I guess it helps if you take off all your lug nuts. Okay, so now that the tires are off, we're going to pull the drain plug on the rear diff there, let it drain, and then there's four bolts on the inside of each axle on the back side of the brake drum. Pull those bolts, axle shafts slide out, and then there's 10 or 12 bolts around the diff itself. We'll take those out. And this truck has an e-locker from the factory, so we'll disconnect that harness and then the diff's out. So pretty simple job. If you've never done it, don't be afraid to. Just dive in. Honestly, not that hard. And doesn't take very long. So we just pulled the uh, just the drain plug 
and we're already seeing pieces of the ring gear. So that right there, like I said, I'm 100% confident that it's the diff. So let's just pull that baby out and let's find the real damage. All right, awesome, so we got that off. Axle shaft's removed. I just took the whole brake line off because it's easier. And uh, there it is, just four bolts on those studs. And you gotta undo the, the e-brake cable. And then, yeah, just rinse and repeat on the other side. And then we'll pull that center section out of the diff, or we'll pull the, the diff.
hey, uh, I think there's something missing there. Just kidding. So we got that diff pulled. And uh, check it out, dude. Woo! Grenaded my first diff. Just think, Zach. Pretty good. Thanks for your help, buddy. Mm -hmm. Couldn't do it without you. Literally dropped this thing on my chest. <laughs> And then he just grabbed me by my ankles and pulled me out. It was, it was hilarious. Should have got that on camera, but the ring gear looks a little chewed up, but I think the pinion's fine. I don't know if you can see in there. But yeah, I think we just lost the ring gear. So yeah, we're gonna order up a gear set and uh I haven't quite decided if I want to gear down yet or not, but that would mean we have to take the front end out. And if we're going to do that, we might as well throw ARBs in. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. <laughs> a lot of work. But yeah, so that's it for today, guys. Next video, we're going to show you how to build a diff and then install it again. So thanks for watching. Give it a like, subscribe. You know, all that fun stuff. And uh, we'll see you later.